Look at this. Look at this. Come look at this. Make sure you watch this video to the end. Stay tuned and let's get started. All right, guys. So, as you see, I did the um the Tumblr, the um image I got off of Etsy. If you want, if you want to purchase purchase it, I got it off of Etsy. I leave the um the the store down in the comment. Um, I'm just showing you the different type of glues that I have used. That's the E6000. I do not like it for that. The, the gorilla that's the super gorilla glue and i like it because it, it has two different as you see that has two different ways you can use it has the brush which is awesome especially for this you have the brush you can brush it on the glue on it's awesome so you have the brush and you have like the regular nozzle that you can squeeze it that to me so far is the best this is the best then as you all know the uv um resin i like that but i just use that at the end as a code and this right here is the um the it's called the gorilla glue epropsy it's the no the gorilla glue par epropsy it, it's like an adhesive type of glue you have to use it really really quick probably it tells you within like five minutes because it really like hard and you if anybody that that knows about resin and the proxy you know you get a certain amount of time before as it start cure and when it start hardening with this one it, it gives you like about five minutes no lie to me it seemed less than five minutes and as you see in the way it's made when you squeeze it you get equal parts so you get part glue and part proxy and you then you mix it and then you apply it it really hard and quick so you have to move quick with it and as you see i'm not i'm struggling trying to put the top back on it which i probably should have just left it and mixed it and then came back and put the top on it because it wasn't it wouldn't have hurt it so i kind of wasted a little bit of time so as you see I picked the proxy, but as you see, is all the my um hooks are already on the um tumbler. I had already put it on. I had used the um the U the UV resin to put it on, and I put a little bit of the the gorilla glue that I showed you on it, and I had already said so. It had already set like overnight, so. And so what I'm doing now is to secure it again. I just want to go around it. This is my first time. Well, actually my second time using this right here. The Gorilla Glue a Propsy. I didn't use. I use it on the. um, Not the tumbler, but on something else. And it was okay. It really worked. It lasts. But um, the E6000 guys. I mean. I guess stick with what it's supposed to be when you're doing rhinestones and things like that. Yes, it works wonders. It works, but for something like this that you that you're making, I don't know what it is. It's it doesn't it doesn't work. And I thought it was just me, and it's not because I um a tumbler that I made for myself, and I used the gorilla glue, the one I just showed you with the yellow tap tap. Cat, I use that and I promise you guys it been almost uh, maybe a month and a half close to two months and the chain have not buzzed it's super super tight and I don't even use the, the chain I don't even carry it like as some people do it I got it as design the, the chain tumbler but I can actually I have actually sometime carried it and it was fully with my iced coffee so it does work and like i said it's a super glue and it really holds so i highly 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 recommend it but it's up to you but like i said that's something that i have used and and um and i see it work 
I'm just experimenting with different types because people been saying, oh, well, I use this or use that because I have tried what other people use. I don't, it, it was like another glue that was recommended called the, um, what is it? It calls the, um, the cement. I think it's called a semen something. I forgot the name of it. I'm going to try to put a picture of it. I use that. I bought that. And guys, I promise you, I do not like it. I mean, for, for that, it didn't work. And people, I watched videos where people use it. And they swear up and down to it. I used it. And I did it just the way it's recommended from the... The instructions and everything and even from the way that the person did it i did it and i promise you guys it did not work it did not last so no stick with what you know and you're gonna tr it's gonna take a lot of try and error so i'm just just know that guys until you get what you like so that's why i'm showing you the different ones the different glues that I that I have worked with. I wish I had the other glue there with me to show you too. It's called um I really can't think of the name of it. It's called cement something. I want to say ceiling cement, but I don't think it's not. I know it's cement something. But guys, I promise you, do not. I'm I'm not gonna tell you don't use it. Use what you feel that you want to use, because everybody you know has their own theory on things i just try to um enlighten people on stuff that i try and that and it didn't work and maybe just because it didn't work for me who to say it won't work for you so is is your judgment and it's up to you and i will definitely come back to your on an update on this one to let you know how this held how this held the because like I said, my Fendi cup, it been over a month and a half and I promise you it worked. And you probably like, well, why is she using the um the light over it? It's because even though I told you I did use the U the um the UV resin on it, so I just figured what the it can't hurt it, it can't kill it you know the more the light the more of the um light the the heart the hardness it makes it even though i did it and it already cured like maybe a couple of couple of hours before but hey i just just lesson learning but like i said i will definitely be coming back letting you guys know how it worked how it held up I don't know guys y'all let me know what type of glue if you do this if you make the cheat the tumbler with the chain let me know what you think and what I did was I stepped outside of the box because it's for a little kid so you don't need a little kid with a chain you know I think it's that's that's a little more for the adult so yeah so as you see I changed and I put the strap. Y'all let me know what y'all think. I added the steel. I added the um the keychain. And I added a little fuzzy ball. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what y'all think. Guys.